Welcome to the UND Intramural Dodgeball Online Captain's PowerPoint. Here are the starting and ending dates of the regular season league and the playoff season for this. As the captain, you serve as the liaison between the intramural program and your team. Make sure you are familiar with all sport rules and intramural policies. Make sure that each of your players are eligible to participate and let them know of scheduled game times. Let us know if you're unable to make it and regularly check your email for updates from the intramural staff. Before their first contest, each one of your players must be registered and join your team's roster on iobleagues.com, where you will be able to find all schedules, rules, and free agent listings. In order to be eligible, all players must be a UND student or a faculty or staff member with a Wellness Center membership, be on your IM League's team roster, and have their UND ID on them. Players can be added to the roster at any time before playoffs, but they can only play for one team. Any ineligible player caught will subject themselves and their team to penalties outlined in the intramural handbook. Each team in every game will be rated on a 1-4 to four point scale for their sportsmanship before, during, and after a contest. If a player is ejected from a contest, that player will be suspended from their next game. A forfeit occurs when a team has no players on site at game time. That team will then be ineligible for playoffs, and if they receive two forfeits, the team will be dropped from the league. A default occurs when a team has players present, but the minimum number has not yet been met. Or, if the captain notifies the intramural office that they will not be attending a game at least six hours in advance. If they receive two defaults, the team will be ineligible for playoffs, and if they receive three defaults, they will be dropped from the league. To compete in playoffs, teams must have won at least two games, a cumulative sportsmanship rating of three or higher, no forfeits, and no more than one default. Only players that participated in the regular season can participate in playoffs, and playoff scheduling may be different than regular season scheduling. No individual is allowed to be in possession or under the influence of alcohol or drugs. Any player caught will be immediately removed, suspended from their next game, and reported to UND Safety. Team names must be appropriate. If deemed inappropriate by intramural staff, they will be immediately changed. The intramural staff is first aid and CPR certified and will provide initial emergency care to any injured parties. Participation is voluntary. Any bleeding players must immediately leave the game area and cannot return until the wound is covered, the bleeding has stopped, and any bloodstained clothing has been removed. Report all injuries to the intramural staff. No boots or open-toed footwear are allowed and all jewelry must be removed for all intramural contests. All balls are live until they strike the ground wall or ceiling, or another ball or person. You are out if you get hit below the neck by a live ball, or if your foot crosses completely over the mid-court line, or if you throw a ball that hits an opponent at the head level, or if you throw a ball and it is caught. Make sure to re-enter the game through the back line of the court, and that your players re-enter the game in the order that they are eliminated. In the beginning of the game, players must return behind the 10-foot line after retrieving balls from the mid-court line before throwing. Dodgeballs can be used to deflect throws, but if the player drops the ball during deflection, that player will be out. A ball caught after it hits a teammate is considered a caught ball. If a player makes a basket during gameplay, all eliminated teammates can re-enter the game. This video is only a small overview of the rules. Please read and be familiar with all sport rules and the intramural handbook. Ignorance of the rules is not an excuse, and remember all official calls are final. Like the Wellness Center Facebook page for all Wellness Center event updates at facebook.com slash UND Wellness. Thanks for watching. If you have any further questions, please visit UND.com slash intramurals.